yen for them. It won't match what's on that table. <laughs> but this is a jar with the crest on it and filled with jelly beans. <laughs> will never be the same. <laughs> Gee, if I'd known this was going to be this much fun, I would have done this earlier. <laughs> no, seriously, though, I, I just want to say it's been a great experience. As, as probably most of you know, I've been on leave for the last four of the last six years, and involved in the campaign, the transition, and here, and it's, it's been a great time. And uh, it's been particularly great working for you. I've really enjoyed and, uh, trying to help you achieve some of the things you're trying to do here. And uh, I look forward to working with a lot of you in the months and years ahead because uh, I don't really feel as if I'm leaving. I'm just sort of going to do something different for a while. Thank you. Well, thank you. Thank you. We have uh, another uh, gift that really is being presented from you also. Uh, besides, uh, but this uh, we we thought, Marty, when you go back to Hoover and have all that time on your hands that you might uh, even take up drinking. And in case you do, <laughs> we, wanted you to have, we wanted you to have something to drink out of. So, uh, here you are. That's a heavy one. Ed Gray also has a presentation. Marty, on behalf of the Office of Policy Development, all the professional members of the staff, this is a gift from all of us to you. That's terrific. <laughs> You can use that for the best advantage, <laughs> turning its face to the wall. <laughs> 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 well, we... <laughs> all right. Uh, well. I'd like some champagne. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> this is the artist. He'd love to do this for you. Someday, maybe. <laughs> He's a wonderful man. He did it from a photograph, and someday he would love to do it. He captures the spirit of it. He's a wonderful man. Sergeant Bill Sampson? No, Mr. President, it's nice to see you. Come on in. This is uh, 
Pilot Don Hunter, the man to rescue on the Potomac. Officer Wilbur Land. Hello. Nice to see you. Dr. Bob Hartley. Hello. Paramedic Jimmy Windsor, who's also in the morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Pilot Dennis Doyle. How you do? Pilot Wayne Darnell. Hello. Paramedic Ron Gailey. Pilot Fletcher Conan. How you do? Paramedic Chet Henry. Paramedic Dave Douglas. What you've done for a year now in our own sport since we've been here. Of course, I'm a TV fan of two of you, but I've watched for hours. <laughs> it's been an honor for us to assist in any way we can with your security and cabinets. Very happy to do it. Yeah. We're most grateful. Thanks. How do you. Uh, uh, they're fine if they just type. jog around the yard and he would always run out the northwest gate in his shorts and t-shirt without secret service and go up to the corner of the drugstore that was there then sit there and have his danish and a cup of coffee and read the paper and the secret service caught up with him <laughs> well I, I hadn't read about that one but i remember harry truman one day sneaked out and crossed lafayette park and went to church all well, by himself sat through church and no one paid any attention to him and got back and uh, those are i have to i've got to look around first I have to tell you, <laughs> President of California, one of my favorite stories that happened there, because I was governor in the time of my ex and all the campuses and so forth, and wherever I went, I didn't ask would there be demonstrators, I said, which ones? <laughs> one night, uh, I was going down to a little town, Modesto, California, speak at a banquet there where these people in a small community had by themselves raised money, no government help, to build a very fine medical institution and one of them to clean the block in his car. So now they're waiting for him, but he doesn't come around again. So they put out an all points bulletin that before he can be picked up, he's back circling the block. And the next time around, they stop the car, they drag him out <laughs> over the hood, and he knows, he understands what it's all about. But his line is what I remember. You'll have to cut this off the table. <laughs> <laughs> he said, no, it's no, no. He's just, you got me all wrong. He says, I just want to see the son of a bitch. Thank you all for coming. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. 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 Thank 